Hey everybody, Weem here. Welcome back to State of Decay. This is episode number 8 in what will be a finale of sorts. Now, this series we've got obviously 8 episodes, this being the 8th one, and so it hasn't run for too long. Um, interest in this series has been okay, and while I don't uh, use views or anything as a guide uh, to determine what games I play myself, I do use kind of the viewership, you know, what, seeing what you guys are interested in to determine whether I should post more videos on the channel of me playing. For example, I intend on playing quite a bit more of this game. Now here's the upside, if you've really been enjoying this series, there is a DLC coming out in a few days called Breakdown. And that's going to really kind of change the way the game is played, and I'm really excited about it. So part of this is that there's DLC coming, and in order to uh, play with the new DLC, you do have to start a new game. So there's a little bit of that. But also, uh, this uh, series has done, I would say, average you know, uh, on the channel as far as viewership goes, as far as interest goes that people have had in seeing it. So I definitely appreciate those of you who have been following along and, and really liking uh, what I've been doing, and that's kind of kept me posting more of these. And actually, I will be continuing to do that with the new Breakdown DLC. We're just going to kind of reboot things a bit. So this is, it's kind of weird. This is something I don't usually get into. I don't really like to talk about views of the, you know, uh, various series or videos because I just, I don't think it's that big a deal. I'm just playing games and I'm sharing them with you guys and it's it really doesn't matter. It doesn't matter to me if... You know, you know, not a lot of stuff's watched. It just means that I will continue playing what I want to play, but I just may try different videos on the channel, see if you guys are interested in following along with those. So anyway, like I said, I don't really like kind of getting into the numbers uh, with things here. And so the problem with that, though, is that oftentimes I don't really say much when I bring a series to a close. I'll run a series for maybe three episodes, sometimes for ten, and I will just stop. I'll kind of look at the numbers and go, well, people don't really seem to be watching this, and I will move on. I don't make you know any kind of big announcement about it or anything. The downside to that is some of you are watching this series really, you know, wondering what goes on, and, and I'll tell you, you know, you say, hey, what happened to this series? And I say, eh, people just didn't seem to be that into it. So I kind of changed it up, doing something else, but I don't like to really get in any kind of announcement or anything. I know that some people really like that. They like to know when a series is over, so I'm kind of, I'm a little bit torn. You know, part of me says, well, I really should, if I'm going to be done with a series, play like one more episode and say that I'm going to be done. And that's essentially what this is. I think it might be the very first time I've ever done a video like this where I've said, okay, this is going to be the final episode of this particular series. Um, but what I do want to say is that, you know, I am going to be playing the Breakdown DLC. I will be recording that. Um, so we're going to start brand new with an episode one because the game pretty drastically changes. Okay, I had a little glitch in the recording there, so <laughs> we ended up having to bail on the game. So we're back at the base without the uh, sheriff's car, and I was just about to explain to you what Breakdown is all about and what we will be doing in that series. So I mentioned that it kind of drastically changes the game. So one of the biggest things it does is it fully removes missions, just like Lily is talking about here. Yes, yes. <laughs> Soon we won't have to listen to you. But uh, it removes the mission, so you're wholly focused on simple survival. As, as simple as that can be in this world. So you basically are going to be gathering resources, just as we've been doing. We're, we're going to try to survive. Medical supplies, building supplies, all of that. But eventually we're going to deplete those resources and we're going to want to move on. And somewhere in the world they will have placed an RV. An RV will kind of spawn somewhere. Now, from what I hear, what I read, uh, the idea is that if you can't find that RV, because it's randomly located, if you don't find it within the first hour or so, um, there will be a quest that'll pop up and tell you where it's at. So that's kind of cool. Now what happens with the RV is if you get to the RV uh, and get it working, apparently you have to get it running, uh, then you can leave. And by leave, I mean restart your world, essentially. <laughs> you, you actually don't go anywhere. Hey, get off of here. <laughs> But you basically reboot your world. And what that does is it ramps up the difficulty. Now, one of the cool things about that is that in the RV, there are only six 
spaces. So you can only bring six people. Now they did say that Lily actually drives, so she doesn't count. You always bring her along. But then you've got six more spaces. So if you've got 12 people, you have to decide who is going to come with you. That's pretty awesome. Can we smash this guy in the car? Oh, he blew up before it happened. Bummer. <laughs> so you've got your RV. Uh, I think what they said was that what's, whatever's in your supply, that carries over with you. Um, they were talking about having some kind of limitation to that, but I just read a thing that said they thought that there was no real good and fair way to do that. So they figure that you just take whatever's in your supply. Of course, that could change, although this DLC is supposed to come out uh, three days from now. <laughs> so anyway, you're basically living off the land, getting to the RV, piling your people in, and restarting the world. Now they're going to have leaderboards and there's going to be some challenges. You can try to complete challenges if you want to, but as far as I can tell from what I've seen, they have a screenshot of them and everything, and the way they've been talking about it, I believe those are going to be optional. So you really are just kind of free to do whatever you want, and I've often found myself wishing that we could do that. Uh, in this run, in this series, even over the course of these last seven episodes, I thought, man, I'm really tired of Lily telling me what to do. <laughs> I just want to do my own thing. Leave me alone. So anyway, apparently that's what a lot of people have been saying, and Undead Labs, who makes this game, has said, you know what? We're hearing that a lot, and that's what we're doing. We're going to do that for you. So I think that's pretty sweet. I'm really really looking forward to that DLC so like I said it is going to be this is going to be the last episode of this particular run but we'll pick it up again with breakdown in maybe in the, within the next week or so we'll squish this guy Boom. stop talking <laughs> So anyway, I basically wanted to kind of fill you guys in on that, let you know that the series is coming to an end, this being the last episode, but that we will be back with more. Um, I pretty much have videos scheduled now. Uh, let's see, I think we've got four more days left in the month, and, and this is actually the very last video I'm recording. I have enough videos scheduled through the last four days or so to carry me through to the end of November, which means that after this video is up, I am done for November and have completed my goal of putting up one video each day in November, which is pretty sweet. I really wasn't sure I was going to be able to do it, but we pulled it off, so I'm pretty excited about that. I do intend on doing this again, another kind of one video per day for an entire month, but it might not be for another couple months. We'll see. So let's see, I think what we're going to do in the meantime is, this being the last episode and all, I think we want to do some crazy stuff. So what I want to do is I want to see if I can draw, is this the horn? No, that's my lights. There's the horn. I want to see if I can draw a whole bunch of zombies back to our base and see if we can handle it. Hmm. Yo! You guys need a lift? Hello? There you go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's go this way. Yeah. <laughs> Bring it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. <laughs> you hanging on there? Let's look back here. You didn't bring your friends. There's a whole bunch of them. This is a house here, too, that's supposed to be infested. Let's do this. <laughs> Let's go. Parties at the church! Whoops, I didn't mean to kill him. <laughs> Hello? Oh. <laughs> sure. He's like skateboarding on the back, holding on the back. No problem. Boy, look at these guys don't want to follow. I just drove through here and had like a horde following me at like full speed. I don't know what it takes to get these guys' attention. I don't want to listen to your recording. <laughs> okay, these guys aren't following me. Man, they went crazy before, but not anymore. Whoops, that's too far. Back it up. Oh, the cop car. Let's do that. We'll run the siren. Can I jump out driving fast? Woo! <laughs> Marcus takes a tumble. So anyway, like I said... The Breakdown DLC. Super excited about it. Uh, apparently there's going to be all kinds of new weapons. 
Um, you're going to get... Uh, there's going to be all kinds of new people, two new heroes. And from what I've seen um, them say, if I recall correctly... Uh, let's see. How do we do the... How do we do the siren? Nope, that gets out. <laughs> what is that? Oh, so you can bash people with it. There we go. Uh, from what I've seen, you can actually... When you get your heroes, what'll happen is... You can, uh... Okay, that's kind of annoying. We'll do that in a minute. <laughs> you can actually give them a weapon. I think, uh, something in each hand. And then you can save them. And then they always have those, uh, items with them. The, kind of those two weapons, in other words. And, uh, additionally, when you... Uh, complete the levels each time you get the RV and progress to the next quote-unquote level uh, that unlocks that level so if you fully get wiped out and you lose all your characters just completely taken out you can actually start at the same difficulty you left off at so if you're level four you could basically start at level four so you don't have to start all over you know all the way back at the beginning Ooh, this siren works pretty good we can do some music with it Oh, it's drawing them out. Here we go. <laughs> we'll do this. Okay, now I'm dizzy. <laughs> Are you hitting my car? Alrighty, let's see. What do we have here in the way of a weapon? Now one of the things you guys have been telling me, uh, especially in the last video, was I need to use my finishing move when I knock somebody down. So it's good to know. I actually did not know you could use the finishing move uh, when somebody was down. I thought you could only use it if they were being held or if you crept up on them. Yeah, there you go. What if I go... Ah! <laughs> Get off me. What if I go in here? You're shooting them. That's no fun. Let me take over. <laughs> oh, wait. I can't hit you, can I? <laughs> he doesn't want to be bothered. He's like, um, sorry. I'm a little busy right now. <sighs> can't jump off of there. Woo! Get back. Squish right to the face. So there's the finishing move on the guy that was down. Or at least earlier there. <laughs> Alright, well, that, that could have gone better. I was hoping to really draw them in here and get some kind of craziness going. But I think what we'll do is we'll take this guy back out. Looks like it'll still drive. Run of the siren on. Let's do this. Now, when I drive fast in this car, I get like some lag here. Oh, here they are. What took you guys so? Yeah, you see, you guys are fast. I just got too far away from them or something. Look at them run at me. They're raging. This is like the infestation zombies. Yeah, bring it in for a hug. There you go. This is exactly what I was looking for. Okay, very nice. Whoa, crap. <laughs> Whoa, crap. Ah! <laughs> Run! <laughs> yeah, follow me in here. <laughs> oh, man. Hey, you can't squeeze through the... <laughs> through the wall like that? It's no fair. Wish. <laughs> I gotta practice that more often. Boy, he's making short work of him here. Woo! Nice. Bing! Look at that. We're knocking him down. We're using the finishing move. Well, he wasn't down yet. <laughs> there you go. Boom! See, I can I can take advice. Believe it or not. <laughs> Anybody else here? You. Oh, he's got the gear on. Go down. 
Oh, 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 oh that was kind of cool. Very nice. <laughs> Very nice. Well, that wasn't difficult at all. <laughs> Sweet. One more. Let's go meet him. You're late to the party, man. Don't shoot this one. He's mine. Oh, one-shotted. Let's see. Will this bring any more out of the woodwork? Let's try this again real quick. I'm just going to back this up to here. Take a quick peek around. Did he come out of the houses out there? Oh, he's going to come from the other <laughs> Push you down. Oh, nice. You went over the fence. That was cool. Boom! Very cool. Another one. Yeah. Go ahead. Fall down. Fall down. We're trying to practice our finishing move. <laughs> there we go. Very nice. Well, I figured while I was being reckless, I would take Marcus out and try to clear an infestation. And we had some problems with the recording software. <laughs> and uh, anyway, it disconnected, had some issues. And so I couldn't show you Marcus's death. Marcus went down. So we're going to bring this guy out and see if we can avenge him. And uh, basically, we have two places out here that are infested. And Marcus did a pretty good job. I was able to get through quite a few guys there, but this guy's going to come out here and we're going to see if we can avenge Marcus. Let's see if we can find Marcus's corpse. Straight ahead amongst all the bodies here. And I don't see Marcus's corpse. Oh, it looks like his bag, is, his stuff is here though. Interesting. So you can pick up their bag. Very cool. Well, here we go. Let's see how this goes. Let's see how the avenging of Marcus goes. <laughs> Marcus got very tired. Ugh, get off of me. No, get off. <laughs> Let's run out here a bit. Who's going to get to me first? Push you guys back. Nice. Woo, he's tired. Tired already. Marcus didn't get tired this quick. <laughs> no, get up. Whoa. Yeah, get the big guy. Shove him back. <laughs> oh, he's so tired. He's winded. I think it's the sweater. <laughs> the sweater makes him tired. Get up. Yes. Oh, what did I just get sh <laughs> He just pushed me into the side. No. Oh, I have a chance. Get up, get up. Oh. <laughs> Oh no, Jackson. <laughs> I don't know, but I think I think we need to go try to avenge Marcus and Jackson now with this guy and his cricket club. I'm not exactly sure what that is. It's got like nails in it. Oh boy, we are down to the really messed up car. Can I drive this out there? <laughs> yes, I can. Sweet. <laughs> it has surprisingly good control. I'm actually really surprised. I should be fishtailing a lot, but that is not the case. Okay, Marcus and Jackson. I'm coming to avenge you. <laughs> did I just totally drive through him and it did nothing? <laughs> I think it did nothing to that guy. Oh, maybe he's dead laying there. So, okay, here's the rucksacks again. Let's see. Whoa, whoa, you're very close to me. Boom! Boom! Get on it. Yeah! <laughs> yeah, this guy's pissed. He's out for vengeance. <laughs> see? I still got that finish move going on. I'm remembering it for now. <laughs> Whew, and he's tired already. Now, it looks like uh, he's only got the medicine, so we can go to that if need be. Let's go in here and try to get more vengeance. <laughs> Boom! Screamer. No. 
Stop screaming. It seems like the other zombies pause when you're in finishing mode move. It's interesting. Like, I guess they probably can't interrupt the animation. But anyway, it's kind of funny. It's like they it's like they want to see what's going to happen. What's he going to do? <laughs> I guess part of it is that it goes into slow motion too, so. Oop, use it. There you go. Oh, the screecher, my ears. <laughs> Pop some pills. <laughs> He's like an addict. It's like, despite everything going on around him, he's like, I gotta give him a fix. No, get off of me. Uh, uh. Boom. Yes. Whoa, nice. I gotta get rid of him for sure. No. Hit him. <laughs> there you go. Boom. Kill this thing. Screeching like crazy. Get in there. Do it. <laughs> I will have my vengeance or die trying. Who else is in here? <laughs> Anybody? What do we got to do to clear out this thing? Boom! You're down? Okay. Can I help over this? Hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna get you, buddy. Scotch? On the rocks? No? Nothing? Boom! <laughs> yeah, cleared it. <laughs> it cost me two of my heroes. But I got it done. Let's cruise over here and see just how bad this is. Because we're diving in. We're clearing this place out. Or like I said, we're going to die trying. Let's see, I heard there's a party. Some squatters in here that need to be taken care of. Whoa, my, uh oh, that's never a good thing. <laughs> my weapon is broke. We are now resorting to Jet Li actions. Uh oh, get up. Yeah. Can you do finishing? Yes, you can. That's. I guess that makes sense. I've seen those before. Anybody else? Uh-oh. <laughs> uh oh no! Rage up! Oh, I don't need to do that. There you go. Boom, go down. Yeah. <laughs> While you're down, I'm just gonna put your head against the floor a bit. Get this one. Yeah! Who needs a weapon? Look at this guy, he's raging. No, get up! I was tapping like crazy, it said to tap. Oh, I only have one way out. Oh, and that's the way. We humans appear to be attached by a rubber band <laughs> in a similar fashion to G.I. Joe's. I guess G.I. Joe's were anatomically correct, it seems. Okay, well I think we had enough fun for the time being. I do want to thank you guys for watching this series up to this point, episode 8. And I do hope you tune in for episode 1 of Breakdown. I would imagine that the first episode of that, if I look at the calendar, uh, may come in the... Maybe in the next 10, 11 days or so. Not this upcoming weekend, end of November, but the following weekend after that. Somewhere around uh, maybe the 7th or so of December. Now, that's assuming all things run well with said DLC pack. I'm super excited about it. So, like I said, I really hope you guys, those of you who've been enjoying the series, I really hope you do tune in and check out breakdown i'm really excited to play it and show that to you guys so thanks once again once once <laughs> thanks once again for watching and uh i definitely appreciate it i will catch you guys next time oh he's so tired he's winded i think it's the sweater <laughs> the sweater makes him tired get up yes <laughs> Oh, what did I just get sh- <laughs> He just pushed me into the sign!
Chance, get up, get up. Oh, <laughs> oh no, Jackson. 